hi and welcome to another video by get it done home repairs i will do a video on installing a trellis system here too but that'll be at a future date okay next thing we're going to do is we're going to take some uh, we're going to use some 16 gauge galvanized wire and we're going to string that wire between the poles now i just want to point this out to you we're just going to use a pair of regular cutting pliers to cut the wire and we may need something like this if we choose to take up the slack in the cable i don't think i'm going to but just in case you needed something like that you could install this if you wanted to pull the wires a little bit tighter all right so what we did is we came over here and we took our posts remember they were seven feet tall we drove them into the ground two feet down into the ground like that and we did it every probably every eight or nine feet we did the exact same thing like that then we took our wire and we we are going to have actually two different levels of wire here so we're going to have one level up here probably around the five foot area and this one here is going to be around the four foot area so that way our vines can grow uh, on here left to right of where they come up to meet the wire all right so that's how we put the wire on just like this okay now as i said if you wanted to put those eyelids on there you could do that if you chose to pull the wire tighter now in the future we may wind up putting a wire from here down into a piece of rebar down in the ground over there to pull this a little tighter as the vines get heavier we may need to but we'll see how that develops as the vines get bigger all right so the next thing we're going to do now is we're going to wait for the vines to grow a little bit once they grow we're going to take the uh, the shoots that come off here not the upper ones because these we want to train to go onto that upper wire we're going to take the lower shoots that develop and we're going to bring them onto the wire here and we're going to train them to go along the wire right here all right so we'll do that as the vines start to grow most likely towards the end of the season but that's what it looks like All right, now as I told you before, one of these shoots down here will be coming off. Most likely it's gonna be this one that's coming off here because we actually start, they started growing before I got them in the ground and you don't wanna cut the, uh, the, uh, the wood while it's growing. So we'll be, we're probably gonna do that in the, in the fall or in the, in the winter. And the same thing on these over here. We have two shoots coming off each one of them. So we're just gonna use one as the shoot that comes up and the rest will trim off at a later time same thing over here you can see the two shoots right there we're going to trim off the thinner one right here and we're going to take all of the shoots from the longer ones that come up here and we're going to train them to walk along that wire okay so that's it i'll keep you posted as the vineyard develops i'll let you uh you know see videos along the way but most likely at the end of the season we'll come back and we'll train those vines to go across the wires that we installed as you can see we drove in some seven foot piping into the ground we stretched our trellis or a wire that the grapevines are going to grow across. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to train them now to start to crawl across that wire. Now just so you know, this is the beginning of August, so we still have a bit more time to grow. As they grow a little bit longer, then of course we'll connect it up to the wire so that it actually grows along the wire by itself. And once we get our tomato plants out of here, we'll have a lot more room to get in there and work. Uh, now the grapes, you know, they run in the, the season, or the grow season is a little bit longer than the tomatoes, but once the tomatoes are out of there, we'll be able to get in and we'll teach the vines how to crawl along the wires. And next year we should have a nice, uh, a nice uh, trellis system with all the, uh, the grapes then growing where they're supposed to be. All right, as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.